DARPA's SIGMA program, which began in 2014, has demonstrated a city-scale capability for detecting radiological and nuclear threats that is now being operationally deployed. DARPA is building off this work with the new SIGMA Plus initiative, which is focused on providing city to region scale detection capabilities across the full chemical, biological, radiological, nuclear, and explosive threat space. DARPA initiated a SIGMA Plus pilot study in the spring of 2018, known as Chem Sigma, to provide initial data and insights into how such chemical sensor networks would function. The Chem Sigma sensor package incorporates a chemical sensor, wind sensor, and communications board into a weatherproof housing. Sensors report wind readings and real-time chemical information to a central cloud-hosted suite of fusion algorithms. So the algorithms were developed using a custom simulation engine that fuses multiple detector inputs. And we built the algorithms based on simulant releases in a large metropolitan area. So we took existing data to build the algorithms for this network framework. And with this network, we're able to use just the chemical sensor outputs and wind measurements to look at chemical threat dynamics, how those chemical threats evolve over time as the wind blows, and agent concentrations as it might move throughout an environment. In the pilot study, performers built a small network of sensor packages and partnered with the Indianapolis Motor Speedway, the Marion County Health Department, and the Indianapolis Metropolitan Police Department to deploy the network on site at Indianapolis Motor Speedway beginning in late April 2018. This network and the data collected during events such as the Indianapolis 500 were critical to the DARPA effort, allowing the team to assess the performance of the sensors and network algorithms. These tests were conducted in an urban environment to ensure that the system could handle complex and stochastic background signals. Importantly, the network level algorithm successfully improved system performance by correctly suppressing false detection events at the individual detector level. The group was also able to collect a large, relevant data set and valuable user feedback that will guide ongoing system development efforts. In August 2018, a non-hazardous chemical simulant was released in the Indianapolis Motor Speedway at a realistic threat rate. Concert Fog was also released to serve as a visible tracer. The propagation of the visible tracer was observed in aerial photography. Chem Sigma determined the release location with unprecedented accuracy. The web-based Sigma Detect interface allows the user to view alerts in real time across a variety of devices. Multiple trials were conducted over the course of several days, assessing performance over a variety of meteorological conditions. Releases occurred during daytime and nighttime, with a full range of wind directions and speeds. The Chem Sigma prototype system detected all of the simulant releases and generated zero false alarms over the course of testing or the following month. We're looking at how we might extend and develop and, and make this network more robust and more mature. So we've implemented and, and established the network at Dugway Proving Grounds as part of a DOD test for simulant releases. And so we've shown that the network can respond to a number of different chemical uh, simulant threats. And we're looking at potential future uh, applications of the network in other areas so that we can begin to better understand how the background, the chemical signals that we might find in, in, a, in an urban environment can affect the network and how we can build around those.